which will lead us to our player prop best bet for the Monday night football game. Uh, we've had a lot of success here, uh, nine and five thus far this season on our Monday night football player prop best bet. And hopefully we can continue coming off of the winner that we did have last week uh, against or with, I should say, Portland Sutton up in over five and a half receptions in that game. That one got us to the window. So this week uh, we're going to go with Joe Burrow. I don't think we've ever given this one out as a particular prop, but longest completion for Joe Burrow over 37 and a half yards in this game. And look, we know what Joe Burrow has done this season. He's already at 3,300 plus passing yards this season. But what's really caught my eye, gentlemen, has been the um, longest completions that he's had this season, and rightfully so, right? Because he has, obviously, Jamar Chase there, T. Higgins. And in a lot of those games, they have been playing from behind, so they have been to uh, get those big plays down the field. But the number right now, 37 and a half, it seems like a big number. But guys, you take a look at the last five weeks uh, for Joe Burrow completing a long uh, completion, 41 against the Eagles, 47 against the Las Vegas Raiders, 70 against the Baltimore Ravens, 42 against the Chargers. And then last week he had a long completion of 49. So that's five straight weeks right there. If we go early in the season, he also had a stretch of four games in a row. He eclipsed this number of actually 40 plus on his longest completion. You know, Sleepy mentioned it. Steve mentioned it of how bad this uh, Dallas Cowboys defense has been, especially in the secondary. Uh, there is also a possibility that uh, uh uh, Diggs misses this game here for the Dallas Cowboys in that secondary. So that's only going to open up more opportunities here for guys like T. Higgins, Jamar Chase in this game. It just takes us one big play to uh, for us to get up and over this number of 37 and a half. Um, so I like this one. We both, or all of us, I say, should uh, are expecting to see points in this game. Hopefully it goes to Jamar Chase. We'll have to get this one. Uh, we we'll have to sweat this one out. But I really, really, really love this this week for Joe Burrow. So longest completion, player prop, best bet. Joe Burrow, longest completion over 37 and a half yards. Here, Sleepy, anything you want to add to that? Yeah, I think, that, you know, like a light bulb went off in my head. And maybe it's the, uh, you know, the amateur sports better kind of coming out here. So. You said this could end up being like the C.D. Lamb, Jamar Chase show. And I think that that's, that, that's something tells me that, that you're right with that. And maybe we just, you know, do one of those kind of, you know, betting junkie type of plays where we take Chase, we take Lamb, we take Rush, we take Burrow, we get our longest completion, longest reception, and we put it all together. It's correlated, obviously. Yeah. And maybe we make a little parlay out of that, but... uh yeah, I, I'll be, I'm not going to argue with you. I mean, obviously, I like this prop too. But yeah, I could see some big, big touchdowns in this one. And you know that that Chase thinks he's the best wide receiver in the league. Obviously, Jefferson, you know, has has said he was the best. But you know, CD Lamb is is also thinking the same thing. Like, I think you're right. Like these these two guys are going to go into this game, especially at this point of the year. Like, what do you got to lose? Yeah, let's go out there and let's see who let, let's see who the top dog is. So. I'm looking at that. I might actually put that little junky, uh, you know, betting play in there. That, that's what I'm looking at doing. But yeah, yeah, big plays. Steve, anything to add to uh, Joe Burrow there on his longest completion to go over? No, I was just going to do the SGP right now that Sleepy was talking about and have a little fun with it. Let's see if we can uh, cash this. I expect <laughs> lots of points, lots of yards, no defense, and a lot of money. Let's do it. I think you also tack on 100-plus receiving yards for each of those guys. I think that would be a really, really so, fun. Hey, see, I was worried about somebody getting hurt. I didn't want to get too nuts. So now we're, <laughs> now we're at a six-teamer. <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah, I think once uh, either of you could, if, you, if you guys could put that SGP together, uh, maybe we tweet it out or something like that and see, you know, we have some fun with it uh, this week. A little uh, D-Gen parlay there for all the degenerate. Uh, or, you know, just have a little bit of fun. Don't put anything crazy on it, you know, like a pizza bet or, a, you know, beer bet. I'll type put of it money. together online. As soon as we get done, I'll put five bucks on it and we'll see if it hits. And at least we have, uh, what, what do they say? We have proof that we hit some 16 parlay. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> All right. So uh, just to wrap it up here again, player prop best bet. We'll go Joe Burrow longest completion over 37 and a half yards uh, to cap off Monday night football for week 14.